Hey everybody, welcome back to American Collectibles. So today I'm showing you two Ford machines with some slight variations. Now the machine on the left is um, from around the 1930s. It was one of the first one cent round gum dispensers manufactured by the Ford Manufacturing Company in East Aurora, New York. Uh, the machine on the left also, it's uh, 12 inches in height by seven and a half inches in diameter. The base is steel and it's in the original red paint um, and it has the original uh, black lettering on the globe. What's cool about the lettering on the globe is that it's actually molded and raised from the glass. It also has the original Ford lock uh, and that has been detumbled to open. Ford machines in general are very common, except for the one on the left. The Ford machine on the left is from the 1930s as I stated, and it's a much more rare piece and much harder to come by, especially with the globe. Oftentimes those globes were broken or they were scratched or the uh, Ford raised glass was chipped off, so it's very hard to find them in that beautiful, pristine, original condition. Um, it even has its plaque, which I'll zoom in later, um, by where your gum is dispensed, and it is its serial number, it's serial number 6150. As you can see, uh, there's the embossed raised lettering right there, and right down here we have the plaque, and it reads, uh, manufactured by Ford Sales Vending Corporation, East Aurora, New York, um, patent September 16th through November 11th, 1919. Serial number 6150. So, now looking at the machine on your right, this is a Ford gumball machine from about the 1950s. As you can tell, the price of gum also went up to 10 cents um, a piece. It's also made by the uh, Ford Manufacturing Company. Um, and this piece on the right also has a plaque in front of where the uh, gum would come out. But as you can see, um, they also updated how they created the machine. It actually has a stainless steel uh, base where the gum comes out, a um, slightly larger globe, and they added a topper. Now the topper could be uh, for, as that one says, the uh, Kiwanis Club for donating. So this gum oil machine may have been at a location storefront where when you bought a piece of gum, the money um, that you put in there would go to that certain charity. Or you could have other advertisements. Um, so that's kind of a neat little thing, kind of give it a more personal taste per store it was at. And sometimes, too, it wouldn't be for a charity or organization. It might just have an advertisement of Coca-Cola on top or Pepsi or some other item that you might buy when you're getting your gum. Another thing you can notice is the logos change. You go from the raised glass on the left machine to a uh, decal, which is put onto the right machine. Uh, the decal just says Franchise Ford Quality Vending Productions, uh, 10 cent chewing gum. And then it actually has basic ingredients for whatever um, that gum was you know, sugar, um, the confectioner's glaze, artificial colors, softeners, things like that. This machine, the topper I was telling you about right here, uh, the decal, and then it also has a plaque. It says manufactured Ford Gum and Machine Co. Um, Akron, New York, uh, patent US, um, and attention in case of accident, remove cessation of business, um, please notify. And then down here you can also see it says Ford Gum. Um, and also, right here where you would put in your dime. There is a serial number, which I believe correlates to this machine, A53385. So kind of nice to have those unique touches to identify the machine from any other machine and really make you feel like you have your own one-of-a-kind piece. If you have any questions or um, would like to learn more about these machines, feel free to send us a message, info at AmericanHeritage.us. Check out our website, AmericanHeritageUSA.com. We have these machines and a lot more. Actually, I only have one of the machines on the left, but um, I have a lot of other machines. I have acorns, so I've got plenty to choose from. Um, you can also check out our eBay store, Lucky underscore find 13. Um, and if you, you know, like this video or um, just want to see more, feel free to comment on the post, uh, like us, subscribe to us, uh, you know, Stay in touch. We would love to hear from you and we love to show you more uh, videos of quality that you're enjoying watching. Thank you so much and I hope you um, enjoy the video and maybe even learn something.